Uh, all right. Got my coffee. Whew. In the carry and ready to go. Hey guys, welcome to another Benzin vlog and in another episode of our Suzuki carry journey. Um, I'm in the white one now, the 2020 version. Today I am driving over to Chroma uh, to a company called My Coffee Van to customize and fabricate this whole car into a coffee truck. Uh, we wanted to do it right the first time, we don't want to kind of muck around with uh, you know, alternative solutions. We just want to get it right and make this a self-sustaining coffee truck. We love our JDM cars um, and I've always loved K trucks and I just think it'll be kind of cool to, you know, have this little truck that is very much self-sustaining and can make coffee at any kind of events, uh, attract attention, uh, a carry in my eye or always attract attention. One of the biggest things that we want to try to do in the fabrication is actually retain a lot of the carry shape and not moving it around too much. So I uh, really want to kind of make it still look like a K-Truck without expanding the body width or anything like that. And also retain a lot of the Suzuki carry character or, or, or some of its um, uh, design lines. Uh, so hopefully that can come through. Um, and also uh, irresponsible me looking for wheels now. So if any of you guys know any 4x100 <laughs> inches that's cool to buy, come at me. My coffee van uh, dropped the car off to John and I guess it's on their hands now. Given a bit of a brief, we went run down again as to what we require and what we think would be cool for the truck. Um, and now it's just a waiting game. Two weeks, one month, something like that. Um, pretty excited before Benzin can come to you guys. As you guys can see, um, yeah, exciting times. Got some progress. It was a bit noisy in there, so I couldn't really explain it well. But yeah, it's gonna be a curved exterior. We've got coffee machine happening, fridge generator. So it's gonna be self-sustaining. It's gonna look cool, and we definitely made sure that it kept the line of the K truck. But the, the best part about it is that bench seating on the side with the tray doors. Kind of, kind of can't wait to see what happens next. But yeah. For now, leave him be, let him finish it. Maybe come back another time and see the progress. But yeah, really, really excited guys. And Benson's going mobile. All right, we're in the red carry today, but we're also actually taking the wheels of the white carry that we bought, uh, some gold meshies. Um, to Produce Factory because they're going to refer legends. Uh, they message us and they said they're going to help us out, which is amazing. So we're going to go see them today and see what kind of work they can do. Let's get some magic up. We are here. Well, I don't know where they are, but um, we made it. We made it with the carry. We made it, guys. All right. Where are you, boys? I think that's them. Yeah. Hello. Oh, yeah. It's nice to meet you. Man. Too. Daniel. Tommy. Well, this is it. I'm Tommy. That's Brian. Um, 
So I'll we'll go through the process. So pretty much you bring me your wheels, can look like shit, someone else has done something to them, or painted them, or you know, just fucked it up, it's flaking, it's crap, it's gross. So I'll take the tires off, I'll chemical strip them, they'll come out like probably these bad boys behind this here. Got some blitz, got some VSKFs. Got some weds, got some ground lights. These are all gonna get polished. Yeah, right. So they're gonna go through the ceramic polisher, but we'll take the paint off and they look raw. So they look like that. And then from there, we'll sand any dings, dents, imperfections, any sort of that shit out of it. Not just like a quick sand and throw some pretty paint or some powder on there. And that's pretty, like full restoration, start from scratch, go to bare metal, anything front to back, even if the tire covers it, like it gets completely restored. From there, after we sand prep it, we'll go over here and we'll, we'll medium blast it. It's close as you're going to get to perfection, but we'll strive to get to it. We're not happy or redo it. Okay, so, so, what's this thing? This is a booth. So, it's really, really big. I started yeah, out wanting right. to do everything, like cars, trailers, yeah. powder coat, everything, and now it's just wheels. Nice. So, we're what changing a few things. On, so, we've got an oven. Are you guys real deal so, here? Yeah, so everything starts to finish. Wheel looks like shit, it's got heaps of layers of paint, whatever it's on it, chemical strip it back to raw, all that stuff down here is raw as well, yep. and then repair it, media blast it, hang it up, powder coat it, powder literally just looks like baby, and then baby the powder, finish. sticks on the rack, throw it in the rack, bake it in the oven for a little while, and then it comes out, and yeah, it's just been powder coated, so nice. we mask all the mating flanges, so there's no issues there. Yeah, hey guys, it's a Thursday and we're only Four, three, four days away from the first event. Picking it up today though. Picking the truck up today. There she is. So we're about to pick it up, see what's going on, how it's looked, and try to prep it up for the weekend. pretty cool um, except it's just stuck to the ground we're gonna fix that suspension um, there are a few things that are missing that I'm not really happy with but again it's just a first look we'll go back and we'll try to figure it all out and we'll try to fix everything so Calvin's just trying to have a go before he needs to go to dinner and I'm driving it back and uh, let's hope that leaf suspension is gonna hold until I get to the hills <laughs> It is not the first event that this truck's been out, but um, we're excited. It's stash and collecting cars today. We're all set up, 8 a.m. in the morning. Got a little spread. Oh man, it's been good. It has been good, but we're definitely gonna show you guys around the truck later on, how it works and everything like that, but we're excited for a good day. Not the only event we'll be doing with collecting cars this year. Excited. Oh yeah, this guy's here. BYO coffee. Wow!
Well, there you have it guys. That's the build for our benzene carry coffee truck and it's been a pretty cool journey um, from Cromer up in the northern beaches now here. Uh, we've done two events so far at Stash and it's been a massive success. Now we also dropped wheels as you see in this video to Produce Factory. Now unfortunately those wheels didn't work for this car. A little bit too much work, a little bit too, um, I don't know, we're, we're grown now. So uh, we're on the hunt for new wheels and getting this truck to how we really, really want it to be. But again, as always, MK done great with the stickers. As you can see, the branding is really, really cool and retro. That's what we really want to do. And we've created a whole benzene carry line. Um, but there are more stickers to come to this truck. There are more branding to come to the truck and we are hitting more events out to you guys as well. So now from now, Benzin out to you guys. The pit stop is now mobile.